If you've been wanting to get in the habit of waking up early, but you just can't seem to wake up, this video is for you. I've been waking up early for maybe about the last eight years, and this has been a habit that has been on and off for seasons, depending on what's going on in my life. But it's something I always come back to because I love this habit. Every time I implement this habit into my life, my life just flows so much better. And I would recommend it to literally anyone. So here are my best strategies on how to get up early. So my first tip is to set your alarm across the room or in another bedroom and make sure that it's loud enough to hear and be annoying. You are going to be laying in bed and you're gonna be so annoyed hearing that alarm constantly going off and you can't hit snooze that you're going to get up and that automatically is going to wake you up, make you get out of bed. And also it's gonna alert your body that you have to go to the restroom. Number two is to know how many hours of sleep is best for you. Some of us need about seven and a half hours. Some of us need six hours. Some of us can do well on four. Some of us need 12 hours. Knowing what your body needs is so important. And so once you figure that out, knowing what your body needs, as much as possible, sleep those same exact hours every single night. And you will see how your body, your mind, transforms when you do that. If we undersleep or oversleep, that can impact our capacity to get up in the morning. And so I would encourage you to try to figure out what is the optimal time for you to get sleep and you will know that because you're when you wake up you will feel amazing and you'll be ready to conquer the day all right so my next tip is to have a reward set up for yourself after you wake up so that could be anything it could be a morning routine that you have been dreaming about your perfect essential morning routine do it girl do it. It could be skincare. It could be doing a load of laundry. It could be doing the dishes. Whatever sparks joy. It could be coffee. It could be making a matcha latte. It could be working out. Whatever brings you joy, do that thing. And don't let yourself do that thing unless you have woken up early. If you have not woken up early, no coffee. <laughs> no latte, no skin or care routine. You can only do those things on days where you wake up early and on time. All right, so my next tip, you probably are not gonna like this one, but get accountability. Get someone to wake you up. So that could be an in-person thing where they come and tap you on the shoulder and say, hey, get up. Or that could be someone calling you on the phone and making sure that you're awake. My next tip, you're definitely not gonna like this one. And it's a super hard habit to break, but stop hitting snooze. I. I'm telling you, when you break this habit, this will be a game changer for you because then when the alarm goes off, your body's just gonna get up. Sometimes your body's gonna just get up right before the alarm, right when the alarm is about to go off. And you're gonna be so amazed when you're able to break this habit. It is the hardest habit to break. I'm telling you that it's gonna be, it's gonna be life-changing, trust me. Okay, so this one I really like because it's kind of fun. Um, this tip is to plan to meet with a friend early in the morning so plan to go out for a walk with a friend go to coffee do something early with you're gonna have to pick a morning person pick someone to do something with and trust me that when you feel that burden to try to get up and meet somebody that is a good way to get up in the morning all right so this is another tip is to wake up and go to sleep at the same time every single day as much as you can every single day this helps with your circadian rhythm i'll link more about that in the description below but having a rhythm your body will know when to wake up when to go to sleep this is a great way to set your body and also know how many hours is good for you waking up early is going to transform your life trust me i would recommend it to anyone you accomplish so much when you wake up early especially if you wake up two hours before you have to leave the house you can do a load of laundry you can work out you can clean the house you can cook you can cook a meal all these things if you wake up early and it's amazing you feel so productive so energized when you're able to do that so i would recommend it let me know in the comments below which habit are you going to try i would love to hear which one works out for you so if you got value out of this video and you like faith-based content hit the thumbs up and subscribe i would love to have you in this community we'll talk soon i'm thinking maybe i should start a podcast that like is just in my car like, it just seems like this is just the right way to go about it. What do y'all think? What should we call this podcast? No excuses, right? We're recording.